We know about the 345 triangle as forming a, a 90 degree triangle, but you may not have space to have 4 metres and, and 5 metres. So another way of forming a right angle is to look at a square. A square of side 1 unit and 1 unit and the diagonal of that square. Now it's a square so we know that's a right angle. And by Pythagoras this distance, this diagonal C will be the square root of 1 squared plus 1 squared which is the square root of 2. Another irrational number if we want this to three decimal places, it's 1.414, and it goes on forever. But this is, um, if you're measuring with a tape measure or a ruler, this is usually sufficient. So, if this was, um, if this was two meter, a two meter square, two meters by two meters, the diagonal would be two square root two. So it would be two times 1.414 which is 2.828. Now you can prove this easily enough, that's a square remember. So c squared is equal to the, it's 2 squared plus 2 squared or I can write c is the square root of 2 squared plus 2 squared. 2 squared is 4, 2 squared is 4 so it's the square root of 8. Now interestingly this is 4 times 2. Now when you're multiplying inside a square root you can do the square roots separately. Square root of 4 times the square root of 2, which is 2 times the square root of 2, which is what we, what we said here, and which is what we've said here. So any square of side length A and A, the diagonal will be A times the square root of 2. This is very handy because if you don't have 3 metres, 4 metres, 5 metres, but you only have 2 metres and 2 metres, then you can adjust this, this position here, you can adjust that until that is exactly 2 metres, 2 metres and 2.828 metres to the nearest millimetre, if you want. Okay, so that will give you a 90 degree angle uh, along, that, along that edge.